Ah, Marcus Conti reporting from the Jones's farm. Ah, nice to be outside. Woo! That's what George Webb calls the truth train. Uh, the truth train, he always says that. Ah, toot toot. The truth train. Uh oh, got a loud sound over here. So, I was looking at the uh, news today. And what is it? There's nothing in there. It's just all, it's all the same, right? Same corruption, same Democrats lying, same Republicans grabbing money, lying, right? Don't ever call me a Democrat or a Republican. That shit is crazy, right? I think that's the truth train that we're trying to, you know, we're trying to project these days, right? Is that what is the truth, right? What is the truth? So, I guess the, the big news was, uh, Kanye West. Who the hell is Kanye West? Fucking, fucking music sucks, right? <laughs> That's my view. I mean, I'm a musician. I have, you know, music hanging, you know, guitars hanging on the wall, instruments, right? I'm not a fan, right? I'm not a fan of, I'm not a fan of uh, the music. But what he said was, was interesting and important. I'll tell you why. Right? Kanye West is a, um, recording artist, but he's also a billionaire, I think, at this point, right? His videos get hundreds of millions of views. And, um, you know, and also, to be perfectly honest, he's the token black, right? right? He's the, he's the, he's the, uh, he's the thing that people aspire to become, right? He's the, he's wealthy, he's got his gold chain, he's got his fucking gold tooth. Uh, this guy's got chick, he's got women, he's got a fucking bling bling, right? <laughs> so, but he said, he said, he said, um, Obama was in office for eight years, and what did he do for Chicago? Nothing. Ooh. Wow. That means he's not black anymore, right? He's not, because he's going, hey, look, the Democratic Party spent a billion dollars convincing the black community that Obama, that uh, Trump is racist. Right? And Ken, Kanye West is saying, fucking, what did Obama do for, for, for Chicago? Right? That's truth, right? Now, I said, I could tell you, you know, what am I? I'm a token white guy, white, white hair, you know, it's a fucking identity politics bullshit, right? But you gotta talk about it because it's important because, because the black community thinks that Democrats, Democrats are for them. I'm a D. I'm a Democrat. You have to be a Democrat. Obama was a Democrat, and he was the first black president. The Obama, because Obama's black, and he's the first black president, and, and Obama, you know, look, the black community voted for Obama in part. More, more so than any other reason is because he was black, right? right. That's the truth. Right? I didn't vote for Obama because he was black in 08. I voted because he ran on a progressive platform of taking down the oligarchy to, you know, to, uh, to get the money out of politics and to break up the banks and all that stuff, right? He, he, he became, not only didn't he do it, but he exacerbated the problem, driving us, you know, driving the, the wedge between income and wealth inequality uh, to, to the most extreme we've ever seen it in the United States, at least in modern history. So Obama didn't do shit for us. He didn't do shit for himself. But he's black. He's black. So Kanye West not only not only um, debunked that, sorry, but he he said that he threw his support for Trump. Oh well, shit, you can't do that. And then Trump, CNN spent a billion dollars convincing you that uh, he's he's racist. How can you do that? That means you're a racist. Right? That's what CNN is, kills the media when you do that. Right? That's truth telling. Right? So anyway, are we at a precipice? Is it? Are we really at a? Are we at any precipice whatsoever? Any junction in the road where Americans are waking up to the fact that uh, their democracy has been stolen, that their media has been um, has been paid off, that the media that they think of as news, MSNBC, CNN. Fox, all these all these networks are really just pay for play. Uh, they're TV shows. Right? They're not news anymore. That the, that the real are we in a golden age, right? I, I mean, if if look, if the black community didn't get their golden age with Obama, right? maybe it's not about race. Right? 
Maybe it's not. Maybe it's not a racial issue. Maybe it's not a social issue. Maybe it is. Maybe it is an economic issue. So, but are we in a golden age of media, where where people that the weapon of choice is like what I have in my hand is a camera, and we and we and we 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 communicate our thoughts to each other. Is that the golden age of, of media? That we're all connected? I think so. I think we are. My name is Marcus Conti, investigative journalist, uh, candidate for the United States Senate. Kindly um, read my platform down below. Make a contribution. Uh, I'm running for the Senate. And uh, I'd like to keep this uh, channel alive. Peace out.